Republic fleet. Hello there. Jack Ann Tilly's here. Our leave is over. Time to report back for duty. So we're going to take a charter ship down to Coruscant. Manu Maraka Naja. Kinamabam. Yak Manala. Bomogala Apaya. Nilama Imi Anka Anga. Oh, perfect. Kala Ama Mami Mami. Livik Bak. That's good news. Bim Ilik Maraka. Nayanaram. Kam Kalu Amik Manik. Manala Yang Perlu. Amka Kalami Nayakira Nubua. Well, Womitopi, thank you very much. Come on, Jorgen. As soon as we get on this shuttle, we'll be back on Coruscant, ready for the next mission. Well, did you feel that? We're taking off. Here we go. That was a nice little passenger liner. That's cool, you can see the stars streaking by. Cool. People playing Sabacc. Just hanging out. Oh, hello. Excuse me. Yes, can I speak with you for a moment? You Not to be racist, saying, but you look a lot like Bobby, Vet. Right? I'm sorry to bother you, but I was wondering if you've been contacted by any of the ship's officers. I've not been contacted by any of the ship's personnel. Is there a situation? I heard a rumor that there's an Imperial warship following us. What? I know, I know. The Treaty of Coruscant. But I don't trust the Empire to keep the peace. The Imps will always be a threat. No treaty's gonna change that. It's good to hear I'm not the only one concerned about the Imperials. How do you know about this? I don't tell the passengers anything at all. It's not very reassuring. Telling the passengers that Imperials are nearby would only cause a panic. I suppose. Still, I think it's unsettling to think that there might be Imperials behind us. Oh, shit. We're straight up under attack? Oh, Lord. Oh, shit. What? No! Oh, this is serious. Get up, Jack! Can you hear me? Are you alright? Imperials seem to have forgotten about the treaty. I knew the treaty would break eventually. But I didn't think I'd actually be here to see it. Listen, you have to get to the bridge. The captain will need all of the help he can get right now. Go, hurry. Let's just hope it's not too late to help. It's never too late to try. Good luck. War Havoc Squad, lady. We don't need luck. Oh, shit! For the Republic! Look at this. They sent the gonks in first. What kind of an invasion is this? <laughs> You're gonna be okay. We're gonna get help for you. Man, this is already mass casualties, and most of these people are civilians. This is a passenger shuttle. Alright, we made it to the bridge. Oh, look at that. That is such a cool visual, though. We're getting broadsided right now. Damn. The captain's down. Come on, Tyrus. You can make it, sir. You can make it. He's gone, sir. You're in charge now. What are our orders? Your orders? Weapons are out. Shields are out. Comms are out. There's nothing we can do. You need to stay calm. Who asked you? We're in the middle of a situation. Hey, watch it, man. The bridge is off limits. Sir, we need all the help we can get. If we don't keep it together here, we're finished. Keep what together? The Imperials have us by the throat. We're as good as dead already. Listen to your navigator, man. Keep your head. What's wrong with you? 
Are you really gonna let your ship fall to the Imperial so easily? That ship behind us is one of the biggest in the Imperial fleet. We didn't stand a chance. It's Sir, a big-ass hero chaos. The Imperial ship is hailing us. What? Oh. Well, then put them on. This guy is out of his depth. This is Grand Morph Rikus Kilrin. Your defenses are entirely disabled. There's fucking guy. We're aware of our situation, Kilrin. Just tell us why you're here. Your ship is transporting a known anti-imperial terrorist and seditionist, the so-called Ambassador Vin Asara. I've come to collect her. Who? We didn't take any passengers by that name. I've never even heard of this person. Interesting. They must be incognito. I, or incompetent. No matter. My agents aboard your ship have confirmed the Ambassador is there. You have spies aboard our ship? I have eyes everywhere. Imperial soldiers are preparing to board your ship through its primary airlock. My agents will ensure that you do not interfere with them. If you attempt to stop my men from arresting Ambassador Asara, I will have every living thing aboard the Esselus killed. Where is the primary airlock? I'll stop the Imperials as they try to board. Weren't you listening? If we try to fight those slaughterists, we have to cooperate. It won't matter. Kilrin has us now. He'll kill us all. He's famous for it. The only one he wants alive is the Ambassador. If Kilrin gets the Ambassador while we're sitting in his sights, we're goners. Those soldiers have to be stopped before they can succeed. I can hold the line against a pack of imps any day. It's very brave of you to volunteer. <laughs> he sounded like he was going to laugh I'm in that sorry line. sorry I lost it earlier. It means a lot to have your help right now. Thank you. It's all good, dude. As a soldier of the Republic, it's my duty to help. Maybe so, but we appreciate your help all the same. I'll have our security team meet you by the primary airlock. They haven't seen much action, but Commander Narlock knows his stuff. Good luck. We're all counting on you. See, this is what being in Havoc Squad is all about. Helping out the Republic wherever you can. Tavis would never. <laughs> I don't think they're firing at us. I think these are all impacts from boarding parties. Ah! Agents! Commander Narlock, I presume. This is it, man. This is what you've been training for. The Imperials are coming, and we're not going to let them pass, are we? Sir, no, sir. What up, we Tom Kane? Alone. An experienced volunteer is going to help us. The Imps won't stand a chance. Let's move on to the task at hand. Yes, the battle plan. The Imps will cut through any second now. We need to take up defensive positions. Come on, man, form up on me. They're sending in a heavy. Victory or nothing. Surrender. Victory or nothing. The bridge. You have to hurry. It was all a trap. The Imperial set us up. What? Oh, shit. It's a distraction. Stop them. Grenade out! Ah, jogging now! Good job, guys. The battle's not over yet, though. I'm sorry, Commander, but that... that isn't the case. You're the ambassador. That Imperial said that you're the one they were sent to capture. Listen, that's not important right now. We have a serious problem. I think it's kind of First important. Officer Hawken walked us right into a trap. The attack on this airlock was a ruse. After Hawken sent you here, Imperial Commandos snuck aboard. They were led by a Mandalorian mercenary called Iron Fist. We defeated the first group of boarders. There's no reason we can't defeat this group, too. It gets worse, I'm afraid. Oh, great. Iron Fist and his Imperial Commando stormed the bridge, and now the entire area is locked down tight. 
We have to stop the Imperials from gaining control of the ship. That's why I rushed to find you. Something has to be done. What is this all about? Why are the Imperials so desperate to capture you? Because of my work. I'm a Republic ambassador. Oh my god, we don't have time for this. controlled planets and convince their governments to come over to our side. What's our next move? We need to retake the bridge. The longer we leave the Imperials in control... The They're already on the bridge. We need to move now. I already told you. Iron Fist has the bridge locked down. There's no way in or out. Security lockdown. That is bad. Chief Engineer Salem might know of a workaround. You're the security commander. Don't you have the authority to cancel the lockdown? The bridge lockdown can't be canceled from the outside. No, it's Salem or it's nothing. Hmm. He and his team will be down in the engineering section. I'm sure they'll be able to help us. We'll need a diversion. If the Imperials notice the hatches to engineering opening, they'll flood the area with soldiers. My men and I can handle that. Form up, men. We're gonna go start some trouble. Let's get that bridge open. We'll give those imps something to think about, won't we, boys? I'll go along with Commander Narlock. Once you've cleared a path to engineering, I'll double back and join up with you there. Good luck. Thanks. Alright, let's get down to engineering. See if we can override this security lockdown. Get back on the bridge. I feel like we're giving Killerin's task force so much time on the bridge. They could absolutely gain control of the Oh shit! Oh Jesus Christ! Go loud! Main engineering. More Imperial infiltrators. Reinforcements are here. You must be crazy coming all the way down here with the imps everywhere. The Imperials have the bridge locked down. You're getting us in there. The imps pulled the lockdown? You gotta be kidding me. You really cleared Which this I was. Out. I didn't run into a single Imperial on my way down here. Why are you down here? Shouldn't you There's be hiding? To waste. Commander Narlock and his men are being overrun. We have to get the bridge unlocked now. So I've heard. I'd invite you in, but the lockdown has our door sealed too. Can you get the bridge open from there? Depends on how we go about it. Just let me think a minute. What about a reactor reset? That would disengage the security locks, wouldn't it, sir? Yeah, but a reactor reset vents the engineering compartment. We'd be blown into space. Yikes. Besides, controls are on the other side of the door. Tell your lackeys to shut up unless they have ideas we can actually use. He was just trying huh. to help. It's a bit so harsh. He gave me an idea. The secondary conduits. They're spread around a bit, but if you shut them all down, the security will go down too. Then we'll be in business. I'll get the conduits shut down right away. There's no time to go running all over the ship. If we don't act now, the Imperials will overwhelm us. I'm sorry, Salem. We need to unlock the bridge while we have the chance. We have to reset the reactor. Wait, what? You and your men will be remembered. Oh, come on! Send these people to their deaths. Not when there's an alternative. Fine. But you're dooming everyone on this ship. You're shady. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good. You've got no heart at all. I'm practical. Nothing more. Yeah, nothing Crazy more. Crazy witch! Shutting down the secondary conduits will work, I promise! If you're going to do it, go now. The longer you wait, the more Imperials you'll have after you. Don't worry, Chief. I'm not going to let you die in here. Let's go get those conduits.
Oh, cool. They're all down here on the engineering level. This should make it easy, at least. First conduit's down. Let's go. Second conduit disabled, one to go. Cool, now I don't have to murder the entire engineering team. <laughs> I don't know how you managed it, but you did. Security doors around the bridge have opened. The bridge is open, and no innocent lives had to be sacrificed to do it. You were right. I'm sorry. Please understand, I didn't want to kill anyone. I just... It seemed really? Well, you seemed pretty damn, like, sure. confident about it. <laughs> I'll go and help Narlock with another diversion. So you have as little resistance as I don't trust this ambassador. The bridge. You'll still have to deal with Iron Fist, though. And that's no small challenge. That's right, the Mandalorian. What do you know about Iron Fist? I only know Iron Fist by reputation. But he's been doing Grand Moff Kilrin's dirty work for a long time now. He's never been captured, defeated, or even driven back. You have your work cut out for you. Tough missions are what I do best. Just be careful. Mandalorians always have a few tricks up their sleeves. It's true. Right. No more time to waste. Narlock, are you there? Can you hear me? Copy, this is Narlock. Set for second offensive. That's right, Commander. I'm on my way to join you now. Let's hope Iron Fist isn't paying too much attention. Narlock and I will do our best to keep him distracted. Good luck. Jorgen, where are you going? <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, Mandalorian warrior, you're next. The only problem with the crowd, the combat droid, is it gets a little crowded sometimes. Hard to click on loot. Ah! Straight up Imperial shuttles landing in the hangar bay. The airlocks were the distraction, and then Iron Fist's team snuck in just through the front door, basically. Like, honestly, this is pretty um, embarrassing for the first officer of the Esselus to allow this situation to unfold. But to be fair, he's only been in charge, like, since this thing started. He was not the captain at the beginning of the day. It was n no expectation for him to have to step into a, a command role during such a situation. Level 40, nice. 
All right, find our way to the bridge. Uh, get cover. I just realized Jorgen's on passive mode. What the fuck? <laughs> Havoc Squad's coming back from vacation, all right? We're a little rusty, too. All right. Overriding the auxiliary power. Damn. It wasn't even doing anything. Come on. <laughs> God, Iron Fist's clap is so good. Well, well. <laughs> I was wondering when you'd finally show up. This is it? There aren't more of you? How many do we need? Just give up, Iron Fist. I don't want to have to hurt you or your men. Strange view of the situation. Guess you'd have to be a little crazy to put up the fight you have. Let's vape this worthless scum and get back to work. I'm sorry, you're gonna you're gonna vape me? I don't think so. I'ma vape you. I'm working on it. Nicely done. Oh, I guess you're still down here. Got it. First Officer Hawken, do you have any spare shuttles in the hangar bay? Spare shuttles? Yes, we do, but I don't... Then that's our only chance. You have to board Grand Moff Kilrin's ship and disable the tractor beam so that we can all escape. Head on assault, surgical strike, and rapid exfiltration. No problem. Uh, do this every day. I've been aboard warships like Kilrin's. The tractor beam control should be easy to find if you know where you're going. Why have you been aboard a warship like Kilrin's? I don't trust you. Perhaps you should go along to help get the tractor beam shut down. We need every advantage we can get. I'm not sure that's wise. Look, if there's any chance I could make a difference, then we have to try. Ambassador, before you go, take a spare uniform. We wouldn't want any Imperials to recognize you. Good thinking, Commander. Thank you. But let's get moving. Good luck out there. We're all counting on you. Nice. I don't know. This seems like a bad idea. If the whole point of... If their entire objective is to kidnap the Ambassador, why would we bring the Ambassador right onto their ship? It just seems like it's too risky. Hold up a minute. I need to talk to you before you go. I just talked to Salen from Engineering. He told me what Asara tried to make you do down there. Thank you for stopping her. Sacrificing innocent people is wrong. No matter the reason. You stood up for the lives of my crew and risked your own instead. I won't forget that. Listen, I've been thinking. I really believe this plan is going to work. But there's only one way to guarantee that we'll all make it home safe. And that's to make sure the Imperials have no reason to keep chasing us. You want me to hand the Ambassador over to the Imperials, don't you? Yes. For the sake of us all, I want you to leave Asara behind on the Grand Moff ship. Damn, dude, you're no better. If the tractor beam down, we'll be able to escape. But Kilrin will just chase us down again. Unless he's already captured his target. As long as Asara is on this ship, everyone aboard is in danger. I don't know about you but I'm tired of risking all of our lives for that woman. I'm not saying you're wrong, but... Ambassador Asara is a Republic official. It's our duty to protect her. Exactly. It's going to be dangerous over there. 
If Asara didn't make it, nobody would even think twice about it. Dude, what are Just you even saying? It. I'd even make it worth your while if things go the way I'm suggesting. Man, anyway, come on. <laughs> get going. I've held you up too long already. Mm -hmm. Damn, everyone in the Republic military is shady as fuck. Let's go. All right. There's the commander, Republic security guards. Let's go board our attacker's ship. We have to hurry. All right, man. You stay here. Guard the shuttle. This is our only way out of here. It's so hard to click on things behind people. Fuck it, just pull the whole room. Let's go. How the tables have turned. Coming. Sabotaging power station now. Well, I've seen some incredible things in my time, but you just topped the list. Thank you. I'm sorry I couldn't greet you in person. If only you had let me know you were stopping by. If this is a bad time. We could come back later. <laughs> Look at his little oh, no, grin. <laughs> no, not at all, I assure you, I'm quite prepared for your visit. My men will be along shortly. To escort you to the accommodations I've arranged. I guess this is where the fun begins. Hey! I have the only weapon in my arsenal, nor the deadliest. See you soon. I love Kilrin. He's such a smarmy fuck. <laughs> All right, Jorgen, we're about to have company. Ah, shit! Here they come, go a different way. 
Huzzah! It's over, Imperials. I have the high ground. Jorgen, why do you keep going on passive, man? Nice. Select some power consoles down here. This probably won't work. Oh, geez. That's going to be the console over there, isn't it? Alright, boys, let's go. Grab round. Ah! Okay. I hope you realize that this is getting out of hand. You are <laughs> leaving me with precious few options. Defeat the what now? What's an ISS 994 power droid? Power droid? Is it a giant gonk? <laughs> it's garbage shoot? Oh, Jesus. Barely survived that one. God, but it smells so bad down here. <laughs> Oh, 
I think Moff Kilrin fucked up by not just firing on the Esselus when he realized we were boarding them. Nice. She looks good as a soldier. Huh? Oh, shit. Is that a Sith? Oh, no. Damn it, it's gonna be that easy? Oh, jeez, come on! That was fucking brutal! What? Oh my god, Jack, we don't have time for this. Get in there. Greetings, a soldier. What a waste. No soldier can match the power of a Sith. There's nobody I can't handle. None of you will leave here alive. To destroy a dangerous foe, that is the way of a true Sith. But you, you are nothing. Less than nothing. I may not have some fancy boots like you, but I can do stuff. You've totally lost it. People <laughs> scum like you cannot grasp the full nature of the Sith. Okay. The power of the dark side is infinite. Are you ready to face oblivion? A big talk with nothing to back it up. <laughs> Always entertaining. <laughs> All right. Words are nothing without action. <laughs> Go for the Sith! Interrupt. No, get off of- You leave my friends alone? Come on, guys, we can do it! Yes. I'm charging up our main turbo lasers batteries. In a few moments, your pathetic ship and all your pathetic friends will be nothing but floating debris. Damn it, he is gonna do what I thought he should do. <laughs> Come on, get onto the shuttles. We have to hurry. If we launch fast enough, I think we can make it. Are you ready? First Officer Haken doesn't want you to come back from this one, Ambassador. He thinks you'll just cause more trouble. Is this a joke? That spineless, indecisive. He wants you to hand me over to the Imperials? Unbelievable. After everything I've done to save the ship, everything I'm not going to do it, but I want her to know. That scum tries to betray me to the Empire. Wait. You didn't actually agree to leave me behind, did you? I wouldn't leave you behind to die, Asara. Good. I was about to. Well, it doesn't matter. You're going to try and kill me? <laughs> Let's go. That's a great shot. Jack Antilles, the uncompromising. 
We're very much not out of this yet, though. I don't know why we're getting the, the conclusion music right now. Come on. We gotta get to the bridge. Shit. We're taking turbo laser hits. Man, that really is such an intimidating sight to be on the bridge and just have this firing at you. Like, Jesus. Everyone's aboard, Plex. Get us out of here now. Nice. Let's go. We're safe. You did it. You did what no one else could have done. You've saved us all. We owe you our lives. Every one of us. So on behalf of the passengers and crew of the Republic Transport Esselus, thank you. Just doing my duty. There's no reason for modesty. What you accomplished here is truly amazing. I took up a collection from everyone on the ship. Hopefully these credits will help you save other people in need. The same way you saved us. No, I don't need that, man. You guys make minimum wage on here. Please, keep your credits. I'm sure you all need them more than me. That's extremely gracious of you. Thank you very much. You're going to need them for legal fees when the ambassador sues you. <laughs> Awkward. Ambassador it's, it's a relief to see that you made Look at his, look at his body well. language. <laughs> I imagine it comes as a bit of a surprise to see me here at all, Hawken. I, I don't know what you mean. Of course I'm glad to see you. Why would you think differently? I just thought the Ambassador ought to know the full facts of the situation. You must have misunderstood me. I would, I would never. I, I wouldn't do something. Mm -hmm. Thank you for telling me the truth. And for everything else you've done here. The Republic needs heroes like you now more than ever. I just did my job. I mean it. If you hadn't been here, we would all be dead for certain. I should warn you, though. Grand Moff Kilrin is never going to forget what we've done. He'll stop at nothing to get his revenge. Good. It's fine. It's about time I had an Imperial nemesis out there in the stars. Kilrin wants to try me again? That's fine. Just be sure to stay alert from now on. Kilrin is full of surprises. Anyway, enough of that. I'd say it's about time we all relaxed a bit and enjoyed the rest of our trip. Thanks again. And good luck in the future. Thanks. Combat droid, do you mind? Ambassador? Sensors show no hostile contacts. Resume course to Coruscant? Yes, please. It's about time. General Garz is going to be so pissed at us for being late. <laughs> awesome. And we've made it safely to Coruscant. Got our boots back on the ground. Cool. Well, this was a fun little in-between chapters story for the trooper. I've decided um, between each class story chapter, I'm going to try and do a flashpoint or two that fits in with the story but thank you so much for watching um chapter two of the trooper story will be getting next week in earnest yeah i'm still really enjoying this and now that we've got new squad colors and a brand new mustache i'm ready to see what happens next so thank you so much for watching everybody and as always may the force be with you goodbye